Do not look to invest in Calgary real estate in 2023 without knowing the five most common mistakes investors make. It's Drew Allen with the Calgary Home Sale Channel, real estate investor and licensed agent. I work with Calgary investors who wish to do three or more investment transactions per year. If that sounds like you and you have questions, reach out to me. You can book a call through my calendar link or via my contact information below. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the Calgary Home Sale Channel if you like information like this I want to get some more. It lets me know that I should keep doing videos. Today's topic is crucial for any investor, avoiding common mistakes when investing in Calgary real estate here in 2023. I've seen many investors make these mistakes. I've made a few myself and I want to make sure you're well prepared to succeed. Let's review what to avoid. Mistake number one, neglecting thorough market research. Calgary's real estate market can be dynamic and ever-changing. If you were invested in 2009 or 2015 here in Calgary, then you know exactly what I mean. It's essential to gather accurate data analyze market trends, and understand the local economic factors that impact property values. Don't rely solely on hearsay or assumptions. Doing your homework will help you make informed investment decisions. Mistake number two, underestimating expenses. When investing in real estate, it's crucial to consider all costs involved. Beyond the purchase price, you need to factor in property taxes, insurance, maintenance, and potential vacancy periods for long-term holds. If you're doing a renovation flip, make sure you factor in the cost of materials and your cost of labor. That, of course, needs to be factored in over time as well. By accurately estimating expenses, you can determine the true profitability of your investment. Mistake number three not having a solid investment strategy investing without a clear plan is like driving without a destination define your investment goals whether it's cash flow long-term appreciation or a mix of both for your long-term holds or if it's going to be a flip property make sure you have a backup plan as well not everything is going to go the way that you probably want on your first second maybe third even fifth have yourself a backup plan in case and when these problems arise. Develop a strategy that aligns with your objectives and risk tolerance and stick to it. Mistake number four, this one hurts. Overpaying for properties in a competitive market. Now what we're seeing here in Calgary in 2023, it's easy to get caught up in bidding wars and pay more than a property is worth. You can argue that over time, if it is a long-term hold, that your tenant will be paying it off. And as long as you're cash flowing, you should be good to go. If you're dealing with a flip property, however, if you overpay on the front and attempt to sell the property on the other side and the market doesn't bear, you end up upside down on your project. No bueno. Be disciplined and avoid overpaying. Conduct thorough market analyses, assess comparable sales, and seek professional advice to ensure you're making a smart investment. Mistake number five, neglecting due diligence. Whether it's conducting inspections, reviewing contracts, or assessing the property's condition, thorough due diligence is essential. Skipping these crucial steps can lead to costly surprises down the road. The market is hot right now, I understand, and you can be tempted to get caught up in the frenzy of making offers. Take the time to evaluate every aspect of the investment before committing. If you don't believe you have the time to do the due diligence, try to make offers that factor in for a worst case scenario. Now that we've covered these common mistakes, remember that investing in Calgary real estate in 2023 can be incredibly rewarding when done right. By avoiding these pitfalls and adopting a strategic approach, you will be well on your way to success. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the Calgary Home Sale channel if you like information like this and wanna get some more. It lets me know that I should keep doing videos. If you're looking for either buy and hold or fix and flip opportunities here in Calgary, connect with me directly via either my calendar link or contact information. Again, I put those down below. Thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Drew and I will catch you in the next video.